Hello, good day. So, in today's video, it's all about the second to the last topic of chapter 3, the statical stability of floating bodies. So, as you have seen, you have seen uh, three illustrations now or uh, experiments that it involves the floating bodies. So, let's assume na mga barko ni and the same kanang sa liquid as well as ang surface. As I have noticed, a floating body is acted upon by two equal opposing forces. So, this one would be related to applied upright position wherein the body's weight acting to its center of gravity so let's say money ang center of gravity and so this is the weight and its buoyant force acting at the center of gravity that's located the center gravity of displaced liquid so this uh, the displaced liquid is within this that is so, the are ang ato ang buoyant force. BF. No buoyant force. When these two forces are collinear, which is as shown, kani, when si collinear, isa lang ka line, lang acting upon, it floats in an upright position. So again, once ang weight and the buoyant force is collinear or acting in collinear, so the position for the body is upright. However, when the body tilts due to V or wave action, the center of buoyancy, no buoyancy, B U O, shifts to its new position as shown in the B. And the two forces which are no longer collinear produces a couple equal to weight times x. So for example, uh, this is the axis of the body and the weight is here. Tapos CBF. Nabago lang gud yung kwan no and Let's say that is the BF. So, the difference between of the two is the X. The distance. So, at uh, BF ni siya, tapos mag-form po o new angle. I mean, maka create yung angle, no? Yung angle. These angles, the dimensions of angles are wedge of immersion. This one, na kanoblog sa tubig. Wedge of immersion. And this one is wedge of immersion. So, dali ang G. This one is BO. Or region sa buoyant force. Or buoyancy. And ning, bali, ning shift man siya another placement, which is BO prime. As you can see, along the BF, that they ma create na intersection no, between the axis sa body. Uh, its name as M, the meta center. And centroid to centroid of the two wedges is S. Uh, horizontal between the 
center of the which is S. The body, the body will not overturn if the couple makes the body rotate towards its original position as shown in B and will overturn if the situation as shown in C. So, kanina hindi pa ni siya. Stable lang ni siya. Naitabo lang ani because of the forces, no? Like wind or wave. So, kanina is stable. Upright position. And lastly, ang C na figure is unstable. The point of intersection between the axis of the body and the line of action of the buoyancy is called metacenter. Again, this M. But before patamo dito sa mga labeling, so ato sa ang butnya ni label. First one is center of gravity. Let's say dari W as G. No center of gravity G. And intersection nato sa dari ang buoyant force. Dari ang BO, BO prime, kani M, intersection, sa buoyant force, BF, tapos na ay angle na nabuo, which is, gani siya, W to BF is X, and it is subjected for overturning moment. Distance from the metacenter to center of gravity is the body is called metacentric height or MG. Body metis a uh, center of gravity. Distance from the center M. M to the G is called MG. It can be seen that a body is stable if, if M is above G. So, kung M dub above dub ni G, so stable. If lower C, M ni G, so un it is unstable. If M coincide with G, the body is said to be just stable. So, what uh, if ever ang M mo coincide with the G, so if stable ang yapo na to ang body. So, the formula na form na to is writing moment equals to the overturning moment equals to weight times x or the distance. So, there are elements to be considered, no? First one would be the weight. Again, this is the elements of a floating body. The weight, weight of the body, next is BF, the buoyancy force, always equal to the W for a floating body, next is G, the center of gravity, center of gravity, B sub O, center of buoyancy in the upright position no center of the displaced liquid so siya ang center of displaced liquid again ang displaced liquid is katong na consume with the body and the liquid so B sub O center of buoyancy Next is B sub O prime. It is the center of buoyancy in tilted position. Center of buoyancy in tilted position. Tilted. Kani in upright. VD or V, the, v sub D is the displaced volume.
M is the meta center. The point of the intersection between the line of action of the buoyancy force and the axis of the body. So again, when nag intersect ang axis sa body and ang line of action sa buoyant force. So meta center. Another one is the C. Center of gravity so we just center of gravity for we just so si Vigis is form or I form tungod ani no here which of immersion which of immersion double M I I M M E R S I O N for under the water or under the surface and above the surface is immersion S would be the distance between the two the, the distance of two widgets no from its C silang C center of gravity B is the volume 4 of the wedge immersion Theta is the angle of tilting T I L T I N G M B sub O is the distance no from A M to B sub O distance from M to B sub O G B sub O is the distance from from G to B sub O MG the met metacentric height metacentric is the distance from M to G M to G, metacentric height. So, muna mga elements for floating bodies. And with these elements, we can formulate the formulas which are very useful in solving related floating bodies problem. So, let's start with the metacentric, no? Metacentric height. It is the mg equals to mb sub o plus minus mb, I mean gbo. As you can see, m times b sub o plus minus a g. Asan g, tarang g, tarang b sub o. At this one. MB sub O, minusan ani, kay G to M is MG man. So, magmatter ta sa plus and negative. Kasi pasabot ani. It happens when so use minus operation if G is above B sub O. No, kung si G above ni B sub O and use plus if G is below sa center of buoyancy. And always note that M is always above B sub O. No, never mahita po na si M mabilo na B sub O because line of action naman siya. Para si B sub O si M and si G. 
So, sa first scenario, we will be using kay above man, the negative or the minus. And ang our G is below sa B sub O. Ay, ang our G is below sa dilik po. Same ba di ay? Negative. I mean, subtraction. Kaya pa natong operation. So, this one. Always take note of this. Uh, this is the first one formula the second one would be the value of MB sub O the stability of the bat body depends on the amount of writing moment which in return or which in turn is dependent on the metacentric height so the stability stability of the body depends on the RM or writing moment which in turn is dependent on the mg or the metacentric height when the body tells the center of buoyancy shift to a new position b sub o again si b sub o will occur or makita na to siya uh, when the body is tilted especially si B sub prime B sub O prime so actually dari pwede ta makotang B sub O because of the center of buoyancy no, new position ang B sub O prime may ito maklaro dyan na makita if the body or floating body is tilted this shifting also causes the wedge which is B prime let's say this is a B prime to shift to a new position B the moment due to the shifting of the buoyant force is mass equal to the moment due to wedge shift at S so BF times Z equals to F times S diba? And coming from this, so ato ikaw no moment due to shifting is equal to moment due to shifting of wedge shifting of BF ni isa so BF times Z equals to F times S and coming from the earlier formula or buoyancy force or buoyant force which is equals to unit weight times displaced volume and our F is unit weight times volume, no? Since theta, sine theta is equals to Z over MBO. So coming from this one, no? So that is B sub O, B b sub o prime and this one is z here is theta so kaniba so as you can see muna yung triangle na considering the so kung nakatilted muna yung new position so, sign opposite over adjacent. 
as we have known this one is m so z so base sa yung nakita this is hypotenuse diba ang sign is opposite over hypotenuse ang opposite sa triangle is z and hypotenuse is m b sub o therefore coming from here so ito ang formula would be z equals 2 mb sub o sine theta so gikan da rin equation this one mahimo siyang unit weight times vd mb sine theta equals 2 unit weight times BS sa wedge, no? So, cancel ang unit weight. Therefore, our MB sub O is BS over VD sine theta. And always remember na applicable only to tilted body. Tilted, fluting, body. And this is a general formula. And now, let's move to another formula. No? Initial value of mb sub o for small values of theta no for small values lang so ang theta is if small values ang theta is equal to 0 or ang theta is approximately equal to 0 Diba? For example, sine theta, I mean sine 5 theta is 0 0.087, so it is approximately equals to 0. So let's draw another figure so that uh, you can know more or understand, understand more about the topic. So this one would be a tilted body, a tilted floating body. So the this is the axis of the body now. So let's say the array. An axis of the body and what that G? So, center. So, ng center. Let's check. Okay, energy. 
Kung asa si jeans, so dito si grade W. And as you have observed, or you can observe, this is the surface. This place in the area, I mean, and there's a surface. So let's say that area, ito ang... Itong BO and yung position B sub O prime BO sa anak na so BF acting siya sa B sub O prime again the distance of B B sub O to the B sub O prime is X. X ba? Or I'm just... Uh, pwede mo walibog. Uh, let's say it is... X ang hindi na kwan na. And let's say it is Z. Z lang atong kwan nun. Let's use Z. Because Z is the check indicate. So it's upon us. Anyway, let's use Z and as you can observe we have form We just, no, I don't think we just can above and then below the surface. So this one would be uh, here to here is, let's see, it is Y. And the banate C, which is center of gravity for we just see here, as well as ang theta. And intersection between of the BF and axis of the body is M. And the difference or the distance between the two. We just know with their centroid sky S. This one is B prime, and this one to the nakalubog or immerse immersion is B volume so wedge. And let's say this is the length of the object L. As you have noticed, na pute angle na form dari and angle dari angle dari. So same equal lang sa tanan. As you can see, when we consider the ridges, na sa ridges lang ta enlarge no kani enlargement tani. Alak siya. This one, the base is kani B. Katunga man siya. So, B over 2. Uh, I don't think that is any. Atong B, B over 2 base kani, di ba? Dara o kani. May kami niya sa base. So, this one is B over 2. And this one is not yet known. So, if that happens, therefore, kani theta. So, ang kanina side is to be.
to be known pa. So therefore, it is um, kung sokat to, uh, let's say, kung kana, it would be something like b over 2 tangent theta. No, kung x ni, x, let's say, uh, tangent theta equals to opposite over adjacent. Diba? So, paniman ang perpendicular of uh, point of perpendicularity it would be here so opposite over adjacent b over 2 so x is b over 2 tangent theta so money siya ang x next one would be ang s let's work with the s say s is ang sana tumako si s as we know, di ba, kung sa triangle, uh, dari man si C. So, therefore, i-consider na to siya, two-third siya from the center. Kani? Two-third ang C from the center. So, two-third sa B one-half, katunga man ni sa base, No? base is as whole as whole na length plus 2 third over B over 2 if we do the math so cancel 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 it is B over 3 plus B over 3 or simply our S is 2 over 2 B over 3 And ganina, di ba, x dali, kani y. So, ang y na to, so, uh, padakan niya pa na to nino, it would be something like this. Surface ko na yun eh. Theta, di ba, dali ang kanina sa surface. So, therefore, this one also is B over 2. Ano? Ah, Makalibog siya if... So, B over 2, dari. And it is... Diba? As you can see, anak man. Pas ganina. So, therefore, uh, let's use tangent to theta equals to opposite over adjacent so y over b over 2 so our y now is b over 2 tangent theta no same with the x so mga na formulate for this now is the s the y the x and always remember that v just the v is the volume of wedge And B prime is katong immersion na ibawa sa surface. Yung occur no during the tilting. So volume siya sa wedge pero di, wala siya naka-displace sa liquid or fluid. So um, just for now no and with this uh, derivation sa formula or formulation Consider a body in a shape of rectangular paripiped length L as shown. So we consider it. So L kani. So wala na siya close the rest. So that it means na it is extend pa. So the volume of wedge. So formulation another of formulas you know, Which is V. Small V. Again, small v equals to one half, di ba? Uh, area, area no? One half sa area times length man. So, one half sa, ang base is b over 2. And the side is, it's either x or y. So, b over 2 tangent theta. 
and times length. No? Again, ang volume is area times length. So, it is... So, when we do the math, so, tanang mga over 2, it is 1.8 B. Dua ka B, B squared L tangent theta. Or V equals to 1 over 8 L B squared tangent theta. So, muna ang volume sa wedge. Na naka-immerse. When say immerse, naka-submerge. For small values of theta, for small values of theta, S is equal to 2 thirds sa B. So, MB sub O equals to VS V times S BD sin theta. Next is always note na from this, no? Atong ikwan ang value sa V. So, 1.8 LB squared tangent theta times ang S na to is 2 third B. Diba? Coming from here. All over V, D, sa, v, v sub D sin theta. And kanisa atong kwanon. That is at ni. So consider this na as new formula sa MB sub O. For small values of theta. But with small values, no? So, sine theta is equivalent to tangent theta. That explains, uh, for example, sine 5 degree equals to tangent 5 degree. So, it is 0 0.087 equals to 0 0.087. So, same na sila or equi equals. Therefore, wala na ni, wala na ni. So, new formula na naman tayo. And it is... Cancel, cancel. Therefore, mahulog siyang uh, 8 times 3, uh, 2 over kani 4. So, 1 over 12. Tapos, uh, L, B cube. Diba? And V, D. So, this one this one is applicable only to rectangular na floating body. But LB cube over 12 is is under with the condition no wherein I is the moment of inertia of the water line. Therefore, our MBO equals to I over B sub D. Diba? Ang moment of inertia is LB cube diba over 12. So, ganira, pwede rin. Same lang sila. Note, this formula can be applied to any section. No? Ang kani, this one. Any section. Uh, for rectangular section, it would be better na, uh, for rectangular. Section, it would be better we use this one. So, the direct ko lang siya, derive. This 
so far. Na rectangular ni because of this. Pero kani I over v, v sub d so for all ni siya na section. So I think uh, you're ready with the problems. I will be giving problem three problems no. The first problem is So the first example is a, a plastic tube of side 1000 mm and specific gravity of 0 0.8 is placed vertically in water. Is the cube stable? So this question is very short but it has very deep no deep kay yung kuan so let's say uh meaning deep meaning let's say uh this is the cube man so it is square tanan And it is vertical, man. So, assume lang na to niyang ano. So as you can see, uh, everything sided is with 1,000 square meter, uh, 1,000 millimeter. So asa pa na I mean sides. And the problem now is that we need to find the draft. Again, don't forget the draft. Kaya under pa siya sa buoyancy or sa floating, no? And the only thing na matulocate with the draft is that katong formula. So this is now the solution na to ganina sa pag solution na. So draft is simply, di ba, given man ang specific weight, I mean specific gravity. So S sa plastic cube, PC, and S sa water times height. So given man height, which is 1,000. Uh, our specific gravity is 0 0.80. Our specific gravity of water is 1. And height is 1,000 millimeter. So therefore, the drop is 800 millimeter. Diba? We have the drop. And according, accordingly, to locate the B sub O is that shadow on center of buoyancy sa upright P sub O. So, so ato rin i-divide of 2 ang D. Therefore, B sub O equals 2 D over 2 800 over 2 it is 400 mm. Now, from the bottom. So, kanin 800 so from the bottom, dari katunga raman, so this is the B sub O. This one is 400. And, di ba our, our G is katunga man sa body. No? G center man siya, ang weight, placement sa weight. So, therefore, kani, from sa bottom or sa up is 500. And now, si GB, GBO, it is the, sa man, 500 minus 400. So, 100 ang iyang distance millimeter. Kani. So, 100 millimeter. So,
So, karon um, we have the G, we have the BO. We need to find ang um, M. No, M is the metacenter. The only thing is that we use the formula. Itong I over V sub D. Okay, ini shape man to. So, LB cube over 12 ang I. Ang BD is... Asa tong BD? Sa to sang ikon ni eh, as formula. So, our L is... Length na to kani. L mani. So, 1,000 times. Ang base is also 1,000. Cube over 12 over um, displacement. So, uh, weight times length times height. So, 1,000 times 1,000 times 800. So, therefore, makancel na ito ng 1,000, 1,000, isa ka 1,000, kani matuna ni Dari. So, our end or the solution would be 1,000 squared over 12 times 800. Maubos pa ng 12. Madinaminator man. So, therefore, the answer is 104.17 mm. Again, this is the distance from M to BO. So, natay BO, tara... And we know na 100 ang M, a B, a G to B, O. So, medyo ibabaw lang si M, kang G. 104, man, point seventy, Anang dating o? M here, G is here, and B, O. Karon si GBO it is 100 CM is 104.17 Diba as it is said or question is a cube stable so balik ta sa atong condition ganina Ma stable siya when ang M is above sa G Diba So therefore, since MBO is greater than GBO, the metacenter M is above G. Therefore, the body is is stable no mana ang 1 so it takes logic jod para ma comprehend nato ang solution as well ang question so magbantay ta uh, please be aware sa B sub O, sa placement niya, no? sa B, B sub D, sa GBO, sa M, MB O, or MB sub O. Also remember na si M, or si, ano ito, no? Ginaw to M is always above sa B O. Never na siya maubos. So, it explains na dinigid totally na once upright, si G and M is mag as one sila and or coincide. So, medyo magligas lang siya mga millimeter. Just imagine 4.17 na ilang ligas. So, second example. Example number two. So, the second problem is a solid wood cylinder of specific gravity 0 0.60 is 600 millimeter diameter. So, ano no fee? And 1,200 mm in high. If placed vertically in oil, which is having specific gravity of 0 
would it be stable? So, duha no, na ikuan. Hatag o specific gravity. So, it's easier for us to solve the D or the draft. So, let's assume na this one is the surface. Solution na ni siya. And, makukunuhay ni ang cylinder. So, given ang height ani that is 1 to mm and and diameter 600 so now let's find the d the draft so d is equals to is equal to specific, specific gravity sa wood over specific gravity sa liquid or oil or fluid times H 0 0.60 here and 0 0.8 times 1 to or 1200 millimeter so ang draft na to na to is for 847.0 uh, 847.06 millimeter. 847.06 mm. O karon, as usual, so B sub O is katunga sa D, and it is 847.06 over 2, therefore it is. 423.53 mm And now sa GBO ta So maglo sa ta dare no So katunga sa drop it is DBO butang na ta dare From the kani So, it is 423.53. No? And G is katunga sa 1, 2, so mga 600. Ano? So, from here to that bottom part, it's, it is 600. So, 600... GBO 600 minus 423.53 so 176.47 meter and now let's go on with the MB sub O so that makablot akong stable ba siya so I over V sub D and since it is circle or circular ang yung inertia it is pi r4 pi r4 over 4 and the displace is in terms of the kanang tang radius so pi r squared over d no di siya d uh, area times side okay, volume man times d i mean pi r square diba pi ang r it is 300 to 4 4 over 4 and pi 300 square tapos drop is 800 4 7 point 0 6 so cancel na to ni si pi pi Therefore, it is 
300 squared 4 times 847.06 or the MBO MB sub O is 26.56 millimeter no MB sub O so therefore Kanisha if that's the case so below pa si M kang G Murad nila dari si M. Okay, kung ano ko, 26.56. So, therefore, kaneto ang statement. Since MBO is less than si kay GBO, the meta center M is below J, G. Therefore, the body is unstable. So that's the second problem. The third plot, uh, the third example is. So this is the third example. A rectangular skull or skull, 10 meters wide, 15 meters long, and 3.6 meters high, has a draft in seawater of 2.4 me uh, meters. Its center of gravity is 2.7 above the bottom of the skull, above from the bottom of the skull. Determine the following first, the initial met metacentric height, second, or be the writing or overturning moment when the skull tilts until one side is just the point of submergence. So solution A. Initial metacentric height mo, uh, it is simply ito lang na on. And the indicate man dari, it is 2.4 ang draft uh, unounce na itong shape so L is 15 meters And height is 3.6 meters. Tapos wide is here 9 meters. And the center of gravity is 2.7. Let's say that just above the drop. Okay, 2.4 months in drop. 2.4 meters. So, si G dari. So, given naman ang oh, Since given naman ang draft, so, no need to solve it. Just that, if find sa natong B sub O, so D over 2, so 2.4 over 2, it is 1.2, 1.2 2 meters. So, dari B sub O, no? 1.2. And then, sa GBO, GBO, so uh 2.7 minus 1.2 equals to 1.5 meters and mbo mb sub o it is i over i over b sub d and again rectangular man ang scow so lb cube over 12 
B sub D or simply kanina formula B uh, squared over 12D times 1 plus tangent squared theta over 2 Ganitong gamiton No? Uh, so, gawin ito ani or kani, same masag value uh, kaniya itong gamiton din so that ma-actualize na ito uh, realize ang formula so 15 times 9 squared and 9 cube over 12 tapos ang ang displaced volume is 9 times 15 ang drop is 2.4 therefore it is 2.81 meter so MBO Halipod, B is 9 squared over 12 times 2.4 times 1 plus. Ang tangent is 0. Okay, hindi man, wala man nakatelt over 2. So, 0 na ni. Therefore, it is 2.81. So, check, same ba. And now, let's solve the MG. No, ang, ang MBO na to is 2.81. Difference sa GBO is 1.5. 1.5. So, maybe ninglap na. Ninglapas na dyan siya. Na na siya dari. Atong M. 2.81. No, M darin. So, our MG is ito naman MBO minus GBO therefore, it is 2.81 minus 1.5 it is 1.31 So, MG So, muna ang metrocentric height no? This is the answer 1.31 meters or meter sa B according to sa B the writing or of returning moment when the scout tells one side is just that point of submer submergence malubog na siya so mag draw ta take note na mag submerge no uh, thinking na kung pa submerge siya so if ang ato ang to point four ang draft and three point six so there is one point two one point two na projection above the surface so ang pinakakwan corner sa scow ato lang yan eh. Ay, na po niya eh. Dili siya maka-actual. Just that, ang ganiyo na lang nato. Hindi siya ma-actual eh. Hindi na ito i-roller. Or ma-visualize. Thinking na kani ang scow, may touch lang siya. 1.2 so dali
Ano no? So, kani to point four. Tapos total height it is three point six. So one point two. So forming theta here, theta here, and the length is fifteen meters. meters and access sa body let's say ito nga lang anin. center man sya no sa drawing access sa body is here so na ang Let's say that is CG and CM as B sub o dari ang weight is acting at G thinking na kanin dari is a ang atong width is 9 so 4.5 no ang width 1.2 4.5 and ang distance sa C C again it is S So, two-thirds sa B. Two-thirds sa B. Two times nine over three. So, six meters. So, start sa considering sa triangle na na-form. So, kanina triangle, no? From this, as you can see, it Uh, tangent theta opposite niya is si 1.2 adjacent is si 4.5 di ba so our angle here is that equals to uh, theta equals to shift tan or arc tan or tan to the power of negative 1 1.2 over 4.5 ang pagkalpyo ano shift tan tapos 1 times 1.2 over 4.5 or the angle it is 14.93 degrees since as I have uh, told you di ba MBO nakatong nakasubmerge is kani na formula MBO Equals to V S over V D sine theta. So kana tong gamiton. First, let's find the V. So one half area times one man area times length. One half times base four point five times height one point one point two. 1.2 times 15 di ba kailan? so it is 40.5 meters and S so we have already solved so 2 third times B or 2 third sa 9 so it is 6 meters and B sub D B sub D is Diba 2.4 times 9 ang length over 15. Ah, I mean times 15. Body displacement. So, 324 cubic meter. So, input the values solved. 
40 times 6 all over 324 cubic meter kanikay cubic meter ma po ang cubic meter po ang 40 and 6 meters so cancel meter na lang ang mabilin therefore the answer is 2.91 meters MBO so locate na to MBO Si B, B o no kay is kuan? It is 1.2. So, 2, 2, 9, 2.21. So, our M, gawas na siya. That is si M. So, that is mo acting si F, B, F. Si B, dali. So, B, B sub O prime. B, F. So, M, G, itong solvon. Solvon na to. M, G. It is MB sub O minus GB sub O. So, 2 by 91 minus 1.5 equals to 1.41 meters or meter. Diba, the question is find the writing moment so writing moment or om so to be able to solve no uh, as you can see w2 and w it is wx partner sa x so atong pagbasihan ani Here to the M. Axis sa M. So, X. So, summation of forces. Summation of forces, it would be... I think I... To be able to solve pa... It's better na Again, no, kani, we can use this Okay, nani siya uh, we can use the the static equation is ato summation of forces along y equals to zero wherein all going up is positive. So therefore Rm equals to Wx. We times x is writing moment. Writing moment. sa paana RM just to resist the overturning so W here is that BF diba BF man BF rajad na sya kay weight and the BF and equals sa unit weight sa seawater times displace volume so 9.21 times 1.03 times 324 ang BBB sub D. Therefore, our weight is three thousand two hundred seventy three point seventy nine kilonewton. So from the figure, 
as you can see x dari man si m si g and theta so therefore from the figure we need to find first the theta diba na solve na to to so atong theta again is 14.93 and sin 14.93 degrees equals to x opposite over hypotenuse mg no so our x is mg sin 14.93 and we already have our mg it is mg is 1.3 uh, mg tara 1.41 1.41 sin 14.93 degrees so our x now is 0 0.3633 meter of a meter therefore our rm is equals to is equal to weight is 3273.79 kilonewton times 0 0.3633 meter so the rm is 1189.37 kilonewton meter so this is the answer for b so let's recap a is the initial metacenter high or metacentric height it is 1.31 meter and Writing moment is 1189.37 kilonewton meter here. So I think that's very long video for today and hoping that you have caught something no, beneficial for you for solving a static statical statical stability of floating bodies. So next video na ang 10 wall 10 wall stress so goodbye